in terms of kind of the history of ballet and these different art forms, um, especially with ballet, uh, in its Baroque period, uh, where when you look at a classical ballet like Sweden Beauty or Swan Lake or something like yeah. that, it's usually like 18th or 19th century um, influences. And those ballets, while they had a major courtly and imperial feel, um, they also were the popular culture, and that's something that's like really, really lost today. Uh, ballet, there's choreographers who are doing different things, but in general, it's kind of been removed from the pop culture and seen as something uh, that's just not accessible and that doesn't have to be relevant. Uh, but in my opinion, the nightclub scene and like the EDM electronic scene uh, really speaks to a lot of the traditions and a lot of the elements that it was expressing um, in those uh, paydays. Uh, kind of like the sex, rock and rock and roll, a lot of classical. Yeah, one of the things that really drew me uh, to San Francisco is Lines, Alonzo King's Lines Ballet. Uh, that school and that company, I attended the school about five years ago. Uh, and it's just an environment that I absolutely love. Like being a student there, the philosophy was amazing. Uh, it was very holistic and it felt a lot more like an acting school because there is so much of an emphasis on really cultivating yourself as an artist as opposed to being this kind of like Simon Says, monkey do, monkey see, monkey do, um, like submissive yeah. dancer. Um, it was really about living and being art uh, and really being mindful behind what you do. Uh, and then like the company there has that same philosophy and it's just it's just this very rich, wonderful environment. It's like an oasis for dance. <laughs> um, I think I feel like San Francisco nightclubs are very into trying interesting things. I think like culture in San Francisco, I came from New York, so I think culture in San Francisco is just very different from culture in New York. Uh, what's trendy, what's interesting, uh, traditional has different meanings in both cities. Uh, so it's, I feel like I'm learning a lot and I feel like I'm in another country. Uh, just integrating myself into the culture here and exploring this scene. Uh, it feels very much like a different world.